Hey, what's up everybody? DJ Pat here. Happy 2009. This is going to be my first official product review for the 09 season. A lot of stuff came out in 08, uh, towards the tail end of 08, and then uh, first part of 09, things are slowly starting to hit, and I'd like to do uh, some product reviews on a bunch of new stuff that I've picked up. Um, it is a rainy day, so <laughs> what better time to, to, to do my product reviews on a rainy day? Um, it's raining bad outside. Um, I was actually had to go out earlier and I saw a couple of accidents when I was out there, so uh, I think it's better that I stay in. So, But one of the things I'd like to talk about is a product <coughs> Excuse me, by a local company. Um, it's a company called Techologic and it's a portable PA system. And, um, <coughs> excuse me, there are some other companies out there that make portable PAs, uh, but this one I found to be the, the, the best value, uh, the more, most bang for your buck, so to speak. Um, there's a lot of definite benefits to having this particular system that I'm really happy about, and I wanted to talk to you about them now. So, um, this is actually the instruction manual for this PA system. See it? Get a little light on it. There we go. Which I'll show it to you a little bit more. Um, uh, we'll go into it a little bit more uh, when I start demoing it for everybody. So, um, Techlogic makes this portable PA system. Now, back in the day, <clears throat> before they had more, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> before they had more compact systems, we had to bring a big rig if we were doing, uh, again, for being the working man's DJ, doing the ceremonies and the receptions. We had to bring. The, the full system out to do the uh, to do the ceremony. Even when they started making smaller units, uh, Gemini made a, a, a really nice compact. Uh, it's a it's a two disc built in mixer in uh, you know one small system. Odyssey makes a real nice case for it, and that you know minimized the amount of stuff we would have to bring out there, which you know to to do a ceremony, which is nice. Um, but you still have to deal with cables and microphones and relays and and the whole nine. So um, this particular unit right here is is just incredible. I love it so much, and uh, I've used again I've used similar products, but this one I found to be the best one for the money. And I'm gonna go over those um, exactly what it is right now. So hold that thought. Okay, everybody, here's the speaker I was talking about. Once again, this is the Technologic Portable PA. This is the Titan series. Um, it is a 26 pound speaker. It's got a little 8 inch woofer here. And it does produce about 50 watts of, uh, of power. Uh, cool thing about it, you know, I've, uh, amongst many things, is, you know, it's not that heavy. 26 pounds is not a lot. But if you look at the back, this is where a lot of the magic happens. Um, and it's great. I love it. So we'll, we'll go ahead and go over everything, you know, one at a time. First off, when it comes to microphones and using wireless microphones for doing ceremonies and receptions and, and all that good stuff, or more so for the ceremonies, but uh, back in the day, you know, we'd have to have a, a you know, maybe one microphone, let's say a wireless uh, lavalier for the officiant, whatnot, and then maybe another wireless microphone for someone else to sing a song or, you know, maybe do, you know, script reading or whatever like that. Then we've got to, you know, bring out extra relays, cables, we've got to hook them into the mixer. Even if we had a dual system where you had a dual, uh, a dual transmitter that had the lav and the handheld built into it. There's one, but you still got to again, you know, hook that into the mixer, and then you still got to worry about power for that. Now I know I'm being petty. You know, there's only one cable, but when you take into consideration how this system works, the uh, transmitters are built right into the speaker, which is really nice. So you have one independent transmitter for your lav and one independent transmitter for your wireless microphone. <clears throat> now these are custom done. You don't you just go into the store and buy these right off the rack. They're built with certain specifications and what I specified is I wanted a transmitter for a handheld and one for a lav. Down here we have um, a CD player. It uh, will play uh, regular wave format CDs plus MP3. I got an independent volume here for it. The only thing, the only modification I think I would make on this particular CD or uh, on the drive or the speaker itself, if I had my way, I would have a flash drive put in there. I think that would be invaluable to have a little flash drive put in there rather than using Wave uh, or MP3 discs. So, but 
that's something for later. But I mean, I, I don't mean to be bitching. So, uh, it, it, it's a cool speaker. So, as we go down here, um, now we have a little uh, uh, charge button. When it's charging, it's straight green next to the power button. Um, when you get down to about 30%, it'll stay constant red. And then as it gets down to about 10%, it'll start flashing um, that it needs to be charged. Now, I'm talking about charging. What am I talking about? Well, um, we'll skip this for the minute. Right in the back, there is a built-in power supply, which is really nice. So if you're doing one of those uh, ceremonies that's, let's say, on the beach, or you're in a place where you cannot have a generator, this has its own internal battery power supply, which is amazing. I love it. <laughs> uh, you can't get any better than that. And, and because everything is all self-contained in here, everything is built in to that unit power-wise. <clears throat> so, I mean, if you decided to plug it into power, you could, and everything would be running independently from that power. You unplug it, same thing. Everything still runs with the internal power system. So there's not multiple plugs, which is really nice. So again, so this makes more sense now, hopefully. So back up to here. That's how you know you got a full charge on it. When you charge this thing, it's about four to six hours to charge. And then you've got between three and four hours of play, depending on how hard you run this thing. But even if you're doing Gosh, uh, let's say with seating music and a ceremony at an hour, even an hour and a half, you're still way under what you need to be before this thing starts dying out. So um, if you're, in, again, in a situation where you're lacking power for whatever reason, now you're charged. So back to this that I had skipped over. This is the, the tech part of it where you've got your... Uh, master volume and again of course you got your independent volumes on your transmitters and then also your uh, your CD deck then you got your high and your low end um, this is additional microphone volume for here to plug in an extra microphone uh, cabled XLR out or in rather sorry um, you've got uh, for additional speakers a quarter inch so you can parallel your speakers which is nice then you also have RCAs for an audio interface to do an iPod or a laptop or whatever you choose to do, another form of audio to be able to put in there to be played. Now, um, I know we can hook a second speaker up to this, but the cool thing about it is as well is these things are expandable. You've got an extra plate in here for another module and setting up its own transmitter to master slave to an additional one of these speakers. This is the one that this is the one you would tech from. And then you get a second one that's just basically bare bones, nothing but the the internal battery, this stuff, and then the power supply. And it'll have that transmitter so you can set it up master slave and it send a wireless signal to another speaker so you're able to have two speakers or three or four or five or however many you like and I can't tell you how awesome that is now you're totally wireless there's no cables there's no cables involved you can't beat that it's a pretty sweet deal so that's the speaker now let me go on to the uh, the microphone portion of this product